Chapter Fourteen: Manbaekdu and the History of Bare. Part One. Looking at this map, we think that Bare was a very large country, probably very powerful in East Asia. But it collapsed in three days when the Khitan invaded it in 926 A.D. What happened? It is difficult to understand the whole process from the records, which are no more than some fragments in the history books. However, this series's use of cutting-edge scientific data can help us understand the overall picture, at least beyond the missing link of such history. Let's look at these graphs. The graph on the left shows a schematic representation of global climate change and tectonic activity levels around that period. It is a modified part of a climate change history graph made by meteorologist Cliff Harris and climate scientist Randy Mann. The graph on the right is from a paper by Dr. Xu Hui Kai's team, published in the Journal of the Chinese Academy of Sciences in 2016, also slightly modified. It represents the change history of geomagnetic intensity in East Asia over the past 8,000 years. The green line in the middle is the East Asian average. First, from the graph on the left. It can be seen that from the mid 500s to the early 600s AD, there was a period of frequent volcanic eruptions while the global temperature dropped sharply. The period that Bale existed was almost at the lowest point of the cold season. Geomagnetism, which seemed to have stabilized, weakened at a very rapid rate from the mid 800s to the early 900s. This fact is consistent with the 2017 field report of the North Korean Western Joint Research Team on Mount Baekdu. For about 400 years, from the 500s to the 900s, Mount Baekdu continued to undergo significant eruption activities. During this time, the geomagnetic field weakened, and volcanic eruptions were severe. As mentioned in previous posts. The level of tectonic activity is closely related to changes in the intensity of the geomagnetic field surrounding the Earth's outer atmosphere. How the process of this huge eruption was directly related to changes in the geomagnetic field can be seen in more detail in the graph on the right, which shows changes in the geomagnetism above East Asia over the past 8,000 years. Let's pay attention to the part transparently marked with a red circle, showing the trend from the early 500s to the early 900s AD. It shows the geomagnetic change trend at the time of the last stages of the ancient Korean states, together with Bare. You can see the Earth's magnetic field intensity suddenly decreased over East Asia at this time. In particular. In the period from 800s to the 900s, the geomagnetic intensity dropped as if plummeting. Normally, when the geomagnetic field weakens and the influx of external cosmic electromagnetic waves increases, the movement of iron components inside the Earth intensifies as a reaction to it. As a result, more magnetic energy is ejected. And the geomagnetic field is strengthened again, reinforcing the Earth's defense structure. However, if the geomagnetic intensity had decreased so quickly as to be represented almost in a vertical line on this graph, the Earth would have been more seriously exposed to external electromagnetic waves because the geomagnetic shield, its protective structure, had not had enough time to get strengthened. As this process continued, the underground magma passage of Mount Baekdu, which is normally resistant to penetration, gave way to the magma rising up with tremendous force. Let's infer how this process would have impacted the lives of people of Bare. There is one thing to keep in mind: when the geomagnetic intensity drops, the inflow of strong electromagnetic waves from outer space increases. And all living things on Earth, including humans, are affected physically and emotionally. 
Humans tend to be caught up in negative emotions such as anxiety, fear, hatred, and competition, and all animals and plants do not grow well. As a result, crop production is reduced, and when food is reduced, humans become more sensitive and try to secure their own in a life and death fight with neighboring groups.